Look, they're the other engines. That's great news. Maybe one of them will help. Okay, little engine, why don't you... Find an engine for pull the toy train. Now you guys stay here. I'll be right back with a big engine who will haul you over the mountain. So I rolled up to her and said, honk. And then she said, honk, honk. And then I said, honk, honk. And then she said, honk, honk. And then I said, honk, honk. And then she said, honk. And then I went, oh, no, you honk, honk. I have no idea what you're talking about. <clears throat> Excuse me. Oh my gosh, what are you doing here? You look a little lost, Peanut Roaster. Train yard's that way. Oh, I'm not lost. I brought the real boy so you can take him over the mountain. Then you won't have to dig anymore because Dreamland will be fixed and Rusty can be a dream hauler again. I am so confused. Rusty told me about the old tracks. The old tracks? Yeah, you know, the ones that go over the mountain. Huh? Hmm? Hmm? Huh? <laughs> You're laughing. You think that's a good thing? I'm a clown. Laughing always sounds good to me. I'm not sure about that one. I don't think they're laughing for. Well, it. Look, those old tracks are a myth, they don't exist. But Rusty said... Oh, please. He's totally desperate. He'll try anything to get his job back. Now you better take the real boy back to the trade yard. <sighs> Where he's supposed to be. We got work to do here. But what about those trains? Don't even think about asking them. They've got to dig and we've got to rest for the next shift. So go on now. Move your caboose. Well, Tracy, do you think you got an engine to get rid of the toys over the mountain? They don't believe the tracks exist. Tracy Jr. So, they're not going to take us over the mountain? It's okay. We'll just uh, wait here until we find a big engine who believes us. But how long the uh, big engine's going to believe us? You'll get to your kids. It'll just, uh, take a little time. You don't understand. The children have already wished for us, and now we're late. And that's one step away from being forgotten. Forgotten? That means you for forget You? You see, for us, once we're forgotten, we disappear. That sounds terrible for you toys. Well, what about you, little engine? Could you take us? Oh. What do you think, Tracy? Can you take the toys up the mountain? We need a really useful engine to get up there. I don't know. But don't worry. You'll find someone... Bigger, stronger, a real dream hauler. Tilly, we gotta do something. Tracy cannot be like this. I know what you're thinking, Casey Jr. We know. Mount it. 
Well... This like I help you who well birthday tray and I you know, I know you could do it but you succeeded but now it's your turn to, to do this thing. For, for Tracy. Well, you got a point there, Casey Jr. Tilly, Spot, Casey Jr., are you two are talking about the past? Well, yes, Spyro, we are talking about the past. Yeah, that's right. About the birthday train, remember? Oh, yeah, I remember. We don't have time, little engine. There's nobody else. Listen, I was wrong about you. Look how far you've come. You can handle that old mountain. Do you want to just say it? Oh, I will. I'll do it. So, Tracy, are you going to pull the toy train over the mountain? The boys and girls will be waiting for you. Those are the same words that you did to me when I pulled the birthday train, Casey Jr. Oh, that's why Tracy over here will be the next little engine that could. The next little engine that could? Yeah, Tracy. Tilly was the first, and now it's your turn. Well, there's one way to say it. Casey Jr., Tilly, Chip, Tamai and Pumba, Henry, the Skylanders, and Stellis. Now let's go find those old tracks. Oh, right, yo! Let's do this. Gotcha. Hey, wait for me! Oh, Henry, you silly lizard. 890, 